So when we originally made the plan to visit Zach Bagatana Museum, I could not wait to tell you the story. Um, this story that I had decided to tell you was actually one that was kind of like in the back of my mind because I, I told you last night that originally I wanted to do the story on um, Kevorkian. Yeah. It is, but it is such a depressing story and a real story that I, I couldn't do it. I started writing it and then I found myself bawling my eyes out and I'm like, I'm going to bring that to Las Vegas. <laughs> it's supposed to be an upper kind of a podcast. I mean, I get it. Things happen. Um, these people's lives were affected, and they shouldn't have had to go through what they, they went through, but also he shouldn't have been practicing without a license. I mean, yeah, I mean, they, they make there. those rules for a reason. Right. There are people that will, uh, you know, practice without a license and do things that are are not helpful towards people, yeah. and it's only helpful towards their pocket or something. Yeah. So they, there's a fine line. You know, I agree. Oh, I don't know if I would say I agree, but... I don't know that I see anything wrong with what he was doing uh, on a moral level, yeah. but on a legal level, it yeah, is. it is. So I can't be too terribly upset that the the police or whoever, you know, and you know, brought charges up against him and stuff and went that route. Yeah. Because they have to because he wasn't following the law. Right. Exactly. But yeah. if it, if in that process some things have changed, and that's what the lady said, yeah. that there are some states that now have. Yeah. What assisted, did she um, I, I don't want to say murder. So basically, you can assist it suicide. Yeah, that's it. Thing. Yeah, that's I bet it's are. crazy that they call it suicide still, but I guess it is. But yeah. Well, it's basically, if you're terminal and that's your choice, yeah. and there are, what you say, like seven or nine states yeah. that allow you to do that. So, it, I mean, he created a movement. I mean, yeah. It, and it was rightfully so. It is your choice. You know, regardless of everything that's going on, if you're in that much pain and you're suffering and there's nothing that can be done except for to live it out and suffer, I mean, come on. Yeah. So, yeah, so I decided I couldn't do that story. It's just depressing. It's hard. It's really, really hard. They uh, they even have a copy of the, the movie that you can find on uh, YouTube. Uh, they had a copy of it in the, the Dr. Kevorkian area, and I was just like, oh, God, these memories. I don't like it in here. I didn't not like it in there. You know, there's these stories where people go in there, and they feel overwhelmed with, I don't know, some kind of emotion, and they, they pass out. Um, yeah. They get I, – I didn't have that kind of a feeling in there. I just – I know the story, and, and it was – it was sad to see it, so I wasn't like gonna pass out because there's some kind of dark entity or anything in there. It's no, just you just feel bad for those people that this is, this is how it had to happen for them. Yeah, you know that they felt they had no other choice, and I'm, I'm sure maybe they didn't. And um, but this is how they spent their last moment. Yeah, right. I mean, mm -hmm. it's nice that they got assistance if that's what they really needed or felt like they needed. Uh, it's sad that they couldn't do it in a more peaceful comforting environment than just the back of somebody's uh, van, which I, it sounds like he tried to yeah. make it. He played music, he played for, music them for him and stuff. And yeah. yeah. Yeah, that was pretty nice. And for people that don't know the Kevorkian story, just so you know, like, maybe you've just heard about it a little bit in the news and you're like, how could they, like, agree with this stuff? He, one key note is he handed the, the machine yeah, to the people. That's the he did not part. do it. No, he didn't. He didn't actually inject them or whatever. He he gave them all of the tools that they could, to, you know, basically do it themselves. Yes. And he just made them as comfortable as possible. I guess I guess maybe we should say at least that's what they say he did. Yeah. Because I mean, it is just him and that person. Yeah. Yeah. So. But I don't know. Maybe he video recorded it or something. Maybe. I, I'm just saying now I realize I don't know what the where the proof is. Yeah. That's how it went down. But I do, <laughs> I do think the story makes a big difference when you know it wasn't him. Like, all right. All right. Hand yeah. me the 20 bucks. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. And then give you the shot. You know, it was like, right. all right, whenever you're ready or if you don't want to, whatever. Right. This is your, here's the button. Up to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He did. He put it in their hand. So, uh, yes, needless to say, I'm not doing that story. Um, 